What's up you guys and welcome back to my channel. How's everyone doing today? How's quarantine? How's life? I want to jump right into the video because I got some cute things for you guys that I really want to show you. I apologize if you can hear like noise from outside. I had to open the window. I got really hot just setting up like Next to making my thumbnails, setting up is my least favorite part about YouTube. Everything else, I completely love. So, I got some stuff from Pretty Little Thing. It was on 50% off, and honestly, when a girl sees 50% off, what? Like, why would you not? Like, why would you not? Why would you not? I did get a little excited and opened a few things up. But, for the most part, you guys will be seeing everything with moi. Let's get into the video. So this is the packaging that it came in. And of course, it comes with like the receipt and all that good stuff. So the first thing I got is this mesh crop top. I just thought this was so cool. I think fashion is like art. It just gave me art. It was giving art. I essentially got it because I had gotten this skirt to wear with it and I don't know I just had like an outfit in mind. This shirt is a little like too small this is what i hate about pretty little thing it's like i get a size four and everything one of the bodysuits that i got in like my next fast package coming i got in a double zero because they didn't have a size four so let's see how that turns out i'm looking in the mirror over here it's a little tight for a size four i mean i still like the shirt a lot and i could also wear it with these jeans which is super cute next I got this maxi jersey skirt. This is the skirt that I got to wear with the mesh top. It could be like some loungewear. I could wear it with like some trainers. Real cute going to the mall outfit, you know, walking through the park. I don't think there were any other colors, but I got it in gray because if you know, then you know that gray makes the boot pop. I would have loved if it had like a little slit on the side, but I ain't mad at it. It is really really long as you can see it goes all the way down to like the ankle but i got this skirt to wear with this shirt and i just felt like i would pair it with some stan smiths like some regular like trainer sneakers and just call it a day with that Anybody else gaining like quarantine 15? Cause I definitely am. The skirt doesn't feel big at all because it's like super maxi. It's gonna be like a slight challenge for me to walk in, but I kind of like it. I don't know, it's cute. And I'm looking in the mirror and I'm, I'm feeling myself. Feeling myself seals. I just wish the shirt was a little shorter, unless like, a little, you know, a little stunt, like, you know, like, no. Wait, maybe I can. Hold on now. No, you can't. Yeah, we're gonna keep it like how I had it before. Next, I got this ring detail crop top. It's called the Black Plunge Detail Ring, Ring Detail Bralette. This is like trending. Honestly, I could have really gotten this off of AliExpress for like five bucks, but but you know what? I said 50% off. That's cool, not bad. So I got this shirt. So this is the plunge ring detail halter top, which I originally said that I wouldn't wear with jeans, but I don't hate it. It's super, super comfortable. The material is really, really soft. I'm not really too sure if it's small or I don't really know, but this is definitely one of those shirts where like you are not moshing in this shirt, you are not like raving in this shirt, none of that. This is like 
keeping it cute and that's it because the titties will pop out i like it i just feel like it's a little like high maintenance just because like you have to tie the back and the top so it's giving me like bikini top vibes but i'm not mad at the bikini top vibes just because it allows you to like halter up your tits as high as you want them to go or as low as you want them to go very much giving diy breast augmentation definitely will be sporting in this i'm loving this i'm loving this one i'm loving this one so much and this ring detail is popping i'm really feeling this one this one this one got it so i'll cut the tag over this one too next i got this black crop top my favorite part about it is that it has like this what is this called this twist in the front i also really like the sleeves your girl was really feeling this when she saw this honestly i just noticed i was cutting off all the labels on all my clothes without even knowing if they fit or not so it's really dumb don't be me oh this is like really really cute this is so cute what this is the black slinky twist front flute sleeve blouse i adore God, this is so freaking cute it would be so much cuter if your girl had like some cleavage to go with it like cleavage on the side okay first of all it fits well i got a size four and it's actually size four this material is like nice and stretchy it's also really really comfortable this is popping yes i really like this one i don't even know what i would wear this with like Girl, your basic like jeans. <sighs> like, oh my God, when I put this outfit together, y'all gonna have to see, but for right now, y'all gonna get it with the shorts. That's what it make me wanna do. Cute. <laughs> I really love the design on this dress specifically because going back to my whole fashion is art thing. I just love all the detailing on this dress. I love a maximalist dress. Just because this dress dresses itself, all you need to do is pair it with some accessories and shoes and you're good. Okay, so this dress, I was really excited to try on. Oh my God, and this is so cute. It literally just has like a bunch of Renaissance painting features on it one of the reviews like someone has said they didn't like how it had like a bunch of baby butts all over the dress but i don't see any baby butts there are some naked babies but i think it's actually pretty cute under the dress it has like you know obviously this slip oh, this shit just ripped y'all Oh my god, it's like ripping on each side. This. You know what? You get what you pay for. It drops all the way down to like the bottom of the feet, like that. I'll probably pair this with like some clear ones. So, yes. I actually stand. I love it. I think it's so cute. I think it's twerkable. No, it's not. No, no, it's not. It's not. Next, I got this Bicon mesh dress with the oriental detailing. Grab me, sis. This is what grabs me. I literally cannot wait to see this on. So this dress has the same concept where, like, it's literally the same dress, just in a different, oh, I I the wrong way. just in a different, like, print. And I'm kind of feeling the oriental print. Why does it make me look so flat chested? Like, what the heck? Probably wear silver jewelry with this and not gold jewelry. For some reason, I feel like it doesn't drop as low as the Renaissance one. I don't know if you guys can tell. I do love the color. 
and I do love like the mesh. It's also not that twinkable, so don't count on that. This is very much post quarantine and I'm feeling it. Let me see if this one ripped too. No, it's not. But the slip underneath for both of them, I can say is super restricting, but I don't see it as one of those dresses that is supposed to be not restricting. It's giving date night at Tao. Very much that. This is giving Philippe after the lunch special hours. We get in more than a chicken satay, sis. This is giving no boo <laughs> for lunch. <laughs> I would also pair these with like these black heels or even the clear heels that I was wearing with the Renaissance dress as well. Just so you guys know, everything that I got is a size four. The two dresses fit really well. If you are a size four in the mesh shirt, I would size up. The four is fine, but to avoid like that riding up kind of thing that it might do from it being too small, maybe just do the size six, but hey. Thank you guys so much for tuning back into my channel. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I have way more hauls coming for you guys. So just wait on it, honey, just wait on it. I love you guys and I will see you guys in the next video.